Guess who's back, y'all? After a long and grueling process, we finally figured out what the fix was thanks to another YouTuber called Presidential Playhouse. The voices might sound different, but it's better than nothing. Now let's get cooking with this new game I found on Steam. Fool, you didn't find this game I did. I just showed it to you because a YouTuber I watch plays it. Don't act like you're the one who found it. This game is mad scary, though. Almost as scary as a second term with you as president, but hey, we're gonna find out, I guess. Apparently this game is like a robbery-based horror game, so like there's robbers and stuff trying to break in while you're trying to not get robbed, I think. That Second Amendment is looking a lot better now, isn't you, Dems? Maybe you should start supporting people who pack instead of trying to make the people pack. Nah, no, still not trying to carry a Glock. You can if you want gang, but I'd rather not put people at risk. Yeah, you would be the type of person to accidentally shoot it without thinking. Bro would be having flashbacks of Black Ops 1, like he was actually in Vietnam or something. What's that noise? Is there an earthquake? Is there an alien invasion? This is how the movies start. This is literally how they start. War of the Worlds did the same thing. Dang, someone had a long night. Oh wait, there's a movie clip playing. Lock in, maybe we can watch it. Let's see what they're talking about. Hopefully we're not in a serial killer movie. Have you found yourself in an unfamiliar place? You don't remember who are you. Here, Bro's long, literally describing you, you Joe, when you wake up in the morning, literally saying you lost well. your mind this to some degree. Is Sounds about right, you decrepate brain matter. Why did you say decrepitate like that? First you know of you could have just not said it like an AI. You know the people Take don't know we're AI. The world knows we're AI gang. You'd think you have a brain still then functioning, but then again, it has more miles than a 67 Ford. Why are you gonna say he has no brain, then say he has a brain? Why are you like on and off with that? You need Finally, to pick a side and hold it like the Alamo. Your ass over they here switching up more than the Hungarians in World Insert War II. The I thought you said there was gonna be robbers in this game. Come on, man, I'm ready Contact to cap a bitch. What are we even Health doing Center. watching this PBS head ass documentary? Dude, shut the fuck up. There is robbers. They just have to like get in, I guess. I don't know. I only saw a clip of the game, not the whole let's play. Yeah, calling cap on that one, Chief. You know damn well you watch the Let's Play and probably watch some trash Twitch streamer play it too. We know what you're about, Joe, and it sure isn't being mentally capable. Why does this game look so pixelated? Like, I get you have a trash computer, Joe, but Christ, this looks like a piece of pixel art. Not a fan of it, but then again, Joe is the one playing. That's right. So, shut up, Obama. Oh my God, look. It's the phone I can launch nukes with. Do you guys think I should cook a small country like Puerto Rico or something? We can launch those bad boys. Like we're in Fallout 4. Puerto Rico is a U.S. territory and they have a say in the election. Wouldn't do that if I were you, Buckaroo. You still need to win re-election. Well, wait, actually do it just so I have a better chance of winning. Dude, what kind of TV doesn't take the damn tape? There is a VCR right there. Why isn't this working? God, I'm already hating this game and I've only been on it for like a minute. This isn't the 50s, man. We don't have those crappy box set TVs anymore. You have to hit the power button. Well, you already gave up, it seems. Gotta hit the power button on your brain too while you're at it. You really aren't cut out to be president. You're not cut out to be anything other than a diabetic bitch. Only thing you're cutting out is another slice of pie, you fat rat. Can we lock in, bro? The robbers could already be in the house. Didn't you hear the TV? You're about to get killed, Joe. You need to get out of there. The hell I will. This is my house. I'm gonna defend this like the Alamo. Ain't nobody getting in or out. Well, getting in, there's no one in the house. Wait, what if there is? Nah, bro, I need to relax. Panicking is the main way to die in every horror movie. Did your dementia self really not hear that vase fall over? You looked around, but you didn't acknowledge it. Christ, you're fair to gone. What kind of Canadian head-ass accent was that? Why are you trying to sound Canadian? You're American, speak American. Joe, you're gonna get jump scared or something. You fall asleep and next thing you know, all the lights are off. Who the hell keeps all their lights off? That's where the monsters hide. If you have no lights on, then you're just chopped cheddar. Yeah, this is why Michelle keeps all your money. You really have no sense of cost. You keep all those lights on. That's like a penny a second or something. Shit adds up quickly. Broke bitch is gonna stay broke for real. Why did I fall asleep on the couch while I have a hole upstairs and shit? Wow, why is the mirror broke? Am I really that ugly? Damn, making me feel all bad. What kind of conjuring ass room did you just walk into? Jesus Christ, that doesn't look like a normal kid's room. Like all the stuffed animals are in scary places acting like they about to knife you in the back. Now you can beat stuffed animals, all you have to do is take out their stuffing. Then they have like, no stuffing, so they're no longer stuffed animals, but actually you and stuffed animals. Okay, I think he just had a seizure. Michelle, Michelle, get in here, your husband is having a stroke. Man's getting ahead of Joe, and Joe is already so lost, he might as well be in Narnia. Don Man, can you just like relax a bit? Tired of catching strays because you have no better comparison. Actually kind of sad you pick on the elderly like that. Dude, you're only like four years older than me. 
Settle down, you ain't in a wheelchair yet, but I give it like a month or two. Mr. Oh, I should run for re-election at the age of 81 because that makes fucking sense. Brother is tripping. Literally, he can't walk straight without falling. You know, we haven't recorded in forever and we're basically back the same way we were. The cameras being off might have been the best thing for our friendship because now it's like we're just blindly toxic. This game honestly isn't that scary. It's just a walking simulator. But there are pixels on the screen. Nothing crazy about it. I thought it would be a lot scarier. But the only thing scary is Donald's hairline. Oh, haha, now go back upstairs and see if that door opens. I want to see what you're hiding up here. Oh, wait, I already know. Probably a little kid or like a dead body. One or the other, money line is looking solid on that bet. It's dark as a motherfucker. Turn the light on, Joe. Whoa, holy shit. Joe, why did you kill these people? Dude, you murdered two people for no reason? I'm calling the cops on you, rat. Hell yeah, we got a Glock about time. We had a Glock. We're about to clap some cheeks, my boys. Would prefer a shotgun, but this will do, I guess. Oh crap, another warning. They better not be saying someone got in the house and killed these people. It had to be Joe. Wait, what the heck is happening? Uh, oh my God. Holy shit. Get shot, I shot him. Am I dead? Guys, holy crap. He's on top of you, Joe. Shoot that fucker, shoot him, show him the second amendment. Good God, I thought you died. Oh, that was- Holy, oh, there's another one. Die, you rat, die. Oh my God, I think it's dead. Police department is informing about increasing number of home invasions. Yeah, no shit, there's two intruders dead on the floor. We know there's more home invasions. God, where did they even come from? I swear I didn't see them downstairs and the door wasn't even open. They had to have come through a window or something. This is what you get with four more years of Joe. Two dead civilians and two dead intruders. How much you wanna bet the crime rate in the area is lower here than in Chicago? How much you wanna bet that your cholesterol is higher here than anywhere else in the world? Fat dick can't stop making comments about the election even though you already got Morning. your concession Citizens. speech typed out. Police department is informing about increasing number of home invasions. To protect your property and family, it is necessary to keep the firearms near you. Been saying that for years, stay packed or get clapped. That's my motto. This is why I carry a minigun everywhere. You never know when you need it. I sleep with a bazooka under my pillow and I have turrets guarding every inch of my house. You guys should really come over. No thanks, Sid, from Toy Story head ass. I wonder who these people are? Probably a minority by the looks of it. Whoa, what the fuck, man? That's a little harsh, don't you think? Stereotyping them without actually seeing their race is a bit toxic. Bro literally just stereotyped a whole group of people because he thinks all minorities are bad? I'm just saying, take homie's mask off and you'll seem dumb as hell. Let's just keep going, don't worry about it anymore. Pretend that comment never happened, Obama. I know Joe probably already forgot. What kind of scary place is this? They have a kid's drawing. Jesus Christ. What is that bunny looking thing and a note that has a repeated name? What is happening? This is giving me backrooms vibes. Y'all hearing this? It's really quiet up in here. And I'm guessing this little doll thing over here has a little bit of lore. Someone needs to change that light bulb too. I mean, seriously, that thing is like a strobe light. This plushie named Toby, ask it where are we so we can figure out more context. Bro, stop talking to that thing. That's how the Annabelle doll was. And if you looked at it for too long, that thing would haunt you and chase you back to your own home, bro. Oh, he calls me sir. I like that. And he's not one of those guys in black suits who's required to either. You know what? Toby is my new friend. I'll take him home after I escape. That is if you escape gang, you still gotta figure out how to skedaddle on out of there with those burglar guys trying to clap your cheeks. Now I'm ready for him. I hope they try to pull up and show him the hood version of the president. You know, I was a very well put together hitman for Al Capone. Bro, that would put you at like two years old. What do you mean you were a hitman? Bro was the youngest hitman in history. All I'm saying is no one expects the toddler to know how to use a gun. That's when you strike. Like a viper, no one ever saw it coming. Ah, the good old days. Bro, what the fuck is this place, man? Jesus, you'd think you were in Baltimore or something. Wait, is that a flashlight on the ground? Jarvis and Hans. I can't. Wait, holy God, did y'all hear that? Someone is in the shadows whistling. Oh God, I'm gonna have another jump scare or some shit. I can't handle another one. I can't, bro. Just go get the flashlight, little Bo Pete, and keep pushing. You got a Glock and the thugs don't have one. Well, they have knives, but that doesn't matter. You're still cooking. Bro's getting achievements for just picking up a flashlight. Bro, this game standards are hella low, no lie. You'd think you would have to find an Easter egg or something. Bro, Joe, you don't have to clear corners like a Navy SEAL. I highly doubt there's gonna be anyone waiting around a corner to kill you. Just speed run this shit. 
That's exactly when they get you Obama. Haven't you seen any horror movie ever? You let your guard down and then, bam, you're one, two, three, fucked. Bro, you need to answer that phone, Joe. Why don't you just go answer it? What if it's Michelle or Jill? What if it's the pizza guy at the gate? I didn't order us a pepperoni one earlier. By the way, you both owe me eight bucks. I'm not paying you eight bucks because you bought from an overpriced pizza place. No pizza is worth 24 bucks. Today. You're tweaking if you think we're sharing with you again as well. You ate most of it last time and me and Obama only got the crusts. Yeah, what was that statue, Joe? Oh yeah, Donald, I'm not paying for anything you can solo ride until you die on that one gang. Well, fine, I didn't need y'all's money anyway. I'm a billionaire after all. What's, holy shit, someone shut the door. Someone's on the other side of this door. Hey, let me in, you fuck, I need to get to the next part of the game. I know you're in there. You best not hope I get in, otherwise I'm sending your ass to Jesus. I don't know, man, that phone's still going off, got me a little scared, why would it keep ringing? It doesn't make any sense, like, just hang up, bro, your ass is probably roaming anyway, fee's gonna be hella ass. Yeah, maybe for you, but some of us are on the unlimited plan and don't have minutes. We're not broke gang, just because Michelle takes your money doesn't mean our wives do the same. You broke as hell, Obama, maybe you should write another book that gets bought by the people who watch The View. Is it me, or am I not the only one walking here? I'm a little scared, not going to lie. I wonder if there's someone behind me. I ain't looking back, but good God, it sounds like theirs. <laughs> Holy shit, die spawn of hell. Oh my God, oh my God. Did you guys see that alien looking bitch, Christ? Bro, can you not sound any more AI generated? Like, brother, you sound like you would be the type of person to be asking you what would you like to order with a new self-serve drive through Here, can y'all hold up a second? I gotta go get the pizza. It's at the door. Oh, I mean, my pizza, not y'all's. You guys don't even get to smell it. Broke ass bitches up in here. We don't care, bro. We can cook a Red Baron in the oven and spend like 20 bucks less. Go into diabetic shock, you fat ass rat. Tired of hearing you breathe in the mic anyway, sounding like you just ran a 5K. Yeah, you do be heavy breathing like a marathon runner sometimes, might want to get that checked. Horton, here's a fat man, breath, head ass. Oh shit, what was that, y'all? My money is it was a ghost kid like the one from the Annabelle series, like just a dead kid that got possessed by a demon and doesn't have a way to escape. Or it could be using it as a vessel or something. I don't know, contact Ed and Lorraine Warren. Tuesday, Tuesday, check Rebecca, check Rebecca. Special teams, special plays, special players. We get it, you watch Sketch, brother. Good God, man, can you just not recite that shit like the spaz kid? You really are special, mentally, that is. Bro, can you shut up? I'm trying to clear this place of monsters and that robber group that was taking this place over. We need to establish democracy here like we did with 40% of the Middle East. Well, hopefully we're gonna be successful in this place instead of how we did the Middle East. Not really good there, to be fair. We fumbled the bag harder there than we did in Vietnam. Bro, you hear that girl crying behind that door? Do you think she works with the robbers or do you think she's a captive here? Money line, she's a captive, not gonna lie. Payout is pretty solid on that bet. Joe, we talked about this. You need to stop sports betting. It's not good for your mental. And on top of that, you don't really have a lot of money to be sports betting. You might live in the White House, but you're gonna be the first president to foreclose on that shit. You can't foreclose on the White House. All right, where do I go now, bro? There's gotta be somewhere I can go, but all the doors are locked and I already went upstairs. Maybe I have to get in the elevator. Nope, that's not it, there's no way it is. Yeah, okay, um, I don't know. It could be that you're just missing something. You're breathing like you just ate a slice of pizza like Donald. Yeah, my money is you have to go back the other way, get that a shot, Joe. Well, I mean, which way? There's stairs, and then it's the back way. I swear it wasn't this way, Richard. What am I missing? Maybe I was supposed to answer the phone somehow. I mean, that's the only thing I can think of. Whoever chose your stupid ass to get out of this place deserves a raise. This is the closest thing I can get to cable after Michelle cut off our dish network. Who has cable anymore? Obama, get your ass some Hulu or Netflix. Heck, even pirating the movies would be better. Don't give in to those greedy corporations who don't even allow password sharing for real. Whew. Jesus Christ, that pizza guy had to be new. Made me go outside and find him instead of him just finding me. 24 bucks for him to decide not to bring it to my door. Some bullshit. I stiffed him on the tip too, gang deserved that. Shut up, Donald, with your fat ass breathing. We're reading something. Oh, I got an award, I think let's go. And we have a key, so I think that was the missing piece we needed to find. I think we can progress through the level now, thank God. Christ, I'm gone four minutes and you're still on the same level, bro. You really should let me or Obama play. We probably would have been done by now. Not gonna lie to you, Joe. Bro, you're seeing the same thing I'm seeing. If you have any idea how to get by this level, then just help me, Jesus, it's not that hard. Stop grilling and start helping me through this. 
so we can get more information on the story. I mean, we really can't help you if you're just running around in circles. My guess is you need to go upstairs. There's probably something you need up there. Or, I mean, you could backtrack around the floor you're on now. Best guess I can give you, man. Wow, Obama, that's almost like what I'm doing. Shut the fuck up. If your input isn't good, then don't provide it. Give me something I'm not already doing. Donald, you have any ideas? I know you weren't here for a majority of this level, so it might work to our benefit. Yeah, I have one. We should put you in a home because this is getting ridiculous. I mean, not even coherent half the time and grilling when the grill shouldn't even be on. Bros swinging at everyone and hoping something sticks. All right, kind of saw that one coming. Of course, you're not going to provide any help. Fine. I'll do this on my own, no matter how long it's going to take me. I didn't even need your help in way. Really didn't understand that sentence. Can you repeat it with the use of actual words, you walking bubonic plague? You can't? Oh, no surprise there. Step off your high horse and piss yourself again like you did in Demonologist. All right, Joe and Donald, let's just relax a little bit. This isn't going to help get us through the level. What would help is the fact that we're not going to argue anymore, and we're going to put all three of our chromosomes together to see if we can figure this riddle out. You know, Coach is right. If we want to win, it's on us. For being the guy signing into law that TikTok should be banned, man sure is quoting a lot of TikToks. The irony in that is actually absurd. You know, this doesn't really feel right. Not going to hold you, man. It seems that you're in another version of the back rooms. Now we're not in the back rooms. It's too dark and pixelated for it to be the back rooms. This game isn't even as scary as the back rooms. I've seen scarier games on cool math games. Bro, here we go again, Joe. No one cares that you were the one who used to play Fireboy and Watergirl solo. It doesn't make you any less demented. It sure as hell makes me less of a liability when it comes to gaming. I'm like a hundred times better at every game because of the skill I learned from that. More like a hundred times more likely to have someone die in your presence because of how old you are. You actually have to suck the life out of everyone around you to keep on breathing like a Dementor at Azkaban. You know, you guys yap a lot while we're playing a scary game. Those murderers are going to hear us. And next thing you know, we're going to get capped. I'm not trying to get capped because I run these streets. And if people realized I was weak, they would 100% try to clap me. No one is going to clap your ugly ass. Also just going to say they won't cap you because they only have knives. Have you not been paying attention or are you just stupid? All right, that's too far. Getting called stupid by your old ass grandpa makes you feel terrible because that man ain't bright like he used to be kind of thing. That flame is low-key being extinguished slowly but surely. Ladies, 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 can y'all just kiss and make up? Like we are no closer to getting out of here and I'm pretty sure Joe is almost out of ammo. We are either gonna starve in here or we're gonna get shanked by some wannabe Dahmer kid. Well, you let this old man at the wheel and here we are, no progress, and I'm starting to wonder if he's even coherent enough to play the game, let alone run for another term in office. Bro's gonna die in the White House of old age. Not if your ass kills my brain cells first with all that non-helpful shit you keep bringing up. Brother needs to take a chill pill and get off my case before I catch one. All I know is that phone has to be the longest ringer I have ever heard. Someone probably wants to chat with you, Joe. You should figure out how to get in there with them. Oh, you pinky promise? Christ, you state the most obvious shit and people would eat it like popcorn. Oh my God, Donald is so smart. Dipshit calls me demented but states the most obvious things ever. God, I'm going to do something I'm going to regret. I know it. Best not say the N-word or I'll beat you up, lil' bro. I would like to see that say it, Joe. Bet you won't. I'll buy you Gears of War if you say it, and then I'll take you to the hospital after Obama destroys your life. Gears of War and losing 98% of my voters wouldn't be the best way to have a solid legacy, all I'm going to say. I don't understand why you keep thinking it's all right, and this wouldn't crash my rerun campaign before it actually gets off the ground. Shit would be like the Hindenburg. Yeah, why do you think I want you to say it, save the world time, and just concede the election before it even starts? Congress tried to stop me, and some of the states did as well, but you can't kill what can't die, motherfuckers. Run it up in November, boxing match. You sure as hell can kill something, and it's my brain cells. You open your mouth, I automatically get the effects of smoking 800 cigars. Might as well call me Castro, because I smoke like him. But you're, like, not as cool as Castro. Castro had a personality. You just get told what to say and basically do whatever your advisors tell you. The more I hear you talk, the more I know about why they don't let presidents run for a third term. You would just be yapping all the time and charging your speeches up like power shots in Pokemon. They don't let people run for a third term because then you get bitches like you in the White House with your oatmeal and oxygen tank. You should just be barely able to mutter yes or no about policies. Personally, I believe we should allow presidents to run for a third term. While we're at it, we might as well allow for fourth and fifth terms. I would be more undefeated than the 96 Bulls. God, I would make a killing. I mean, I would do so much good for the country. 
Just wait till you figure out they're going to put a chip in your head that detonates if you come back to the White House. No one wants you here, young blood, so stay away. All the staff in the kitchen said you used to force them to make cake at 4 a.m. Like, who does that? Eat that shit probably like a gremlin, too. This ain't no Paradise Falls from Fallout. They would still let Donald in just for him to get kicked out by security because he isn't even a president anymore. Famous last words, I say I destroy Joe so bad in the next election that man might actually have a heart attack. Brother ain't got a chance yet, he's still taking funding and running against Don the Donald Trump. Can you stop calling yourself that? You ain't any cooler. And honestly, I would like an apology letter for me having to be a victim of hearing that midlife crisis name. Oh, boo-hoo, you want me to play a song on the world's tiniest violin? Get the fuck out of here with that soft mental you got cooking. No wonder Hillary talks about you behind your back. Yeah, I call cap on that Hillary doesn't even like you, and I'm pretty sure she's a dude, so there's the whole alpha mental going on there. Yeah, gang, you ain't talking to he, her pronouns because you're gonna get beat the heck up. Wait, do I go through here? Oh my God, there's no way I was sitting here running by this door every second of my life just for this to be it. Good God, all right, boys, we can keep going finally. Use my noggin and prevailed. Joe, just be careful. That means the jump scares and stuff reset. Oh God, what was that? Who's whistling Dixie over there? Seems like someone was taking a nap or something here. Probably where the killer was sleeping, waiting for the attack on your house to take place. I assume it was him. Can we just relax? We're deeper in the lore and just need to focus. I don't want to miss anything, and I sure as hell don't want the killer to pull up and try to shank me again. Not a fan of that shiznet. Well, think of it like this. He has a knife. You have a Glock. See where I'm going with this? Do you not watch police activity on YouTube? It's like a tutorial on how to not get shit on with a knife while you have a gun. No, I don't watch that shit. Who wants to watch police activity on YouTube when you can watch Modern Warfare 2 gameplay? That is like 10 times better anyway, and it's more realistic than that stuff you see. You can't tell me you were the person who watched GTA content thinking it was real. I mean, seriously, you had to have been that person type of dude to fall for Mr. Beast scams on TikTok. Yeah, bud, he really is giving away 10 grand to the first 800 people to click that mystery link. God. Wait, so you're saying that isn't real? Well, like, hypothetically, what if someone did click on it? Like, what would that entail? Is it something bad or is it like just a joke kind of thing? I mean, I'm just curious asking for Joe because he's too scared to ask. I didn't ask, bro. I didn't click on no fake Mr. Beast ad. I don't ever do that. I'm smarter than that. Now you, on the other hand, you hear buy one, get one free deals from Domino's and your big chungus head ass waddles right into the trap. Well, I mean, it wouldn't be my fault, probably Baron clicking on fake ads or something. It wouldn't have been me because I'm smart. Ha ha, so smart I don't need a tutorial on fake ads. Bro, ugh, never mind, Joe. Just lock in and make sure you don't get shanked by some of these masked beings. For all we know, they could just be trying to be friends. That's why you lost the Middle East, brother, man. Wait, what's that, a kid? Holy shit. Oh my God, oh my God. What was that thing? Make sure you plan a knife on him, otherwise the cops are gonna ask questions. All right, that last shot was kinda un scary Now there's gonna be an investigation. Shit, man, you had one job. Did you just say un scary Donald brother, he had a knife. The last shot was for our safety. If anything, you should be proud. Without the Second Amendment, Joe would have been waiting for the cops to pull up in 30 minutes. Fair enough. Good job, Joe. Response time was a bit slow. But next time, you know, if you hear a kid at the end of a hallway, that spawn of hell is going to charge you like a power forward. Yeah, I don't want to brag, but I didn't pretty well responding to the threat. Wait, oh my God. You saw that? You saw that? Did y'all see that? It was an alien in the darkness. Yeah, Unc, you're seeing things now. I have no idea what you're talking about. I didn't see anything other than you wasting ammo into the darkness. For all you know, you just hit little Timmy trying to cross the road. Hey, little Timmy deserved it if he's walking in the hallway. What's behind door number? Oh shit. Oh nah, that was Annabelle. I remember that Lil Brat from the movies. That was her all right. I know dang well that was here. You guys know that was her, right? Careful, Joe. The kids you keep in your basement are getting louder. Probably should dial it back some and get away from that door before you catch the feds. You're about to catch these hands, bro. Tired of you putting that evil on me, acting like I'm the one who keeps kids in their basement. You literally did shots with Epstein. Get off my case, brother, man.